That was good. High energy stuff, too. <laughs> a, lot, a lot to take in. Is William right, though, about reincarnation? Well, we have uh, several people here who agree with him in principle. Have we all uh, been here before? That's the question. Let's, uh, let's come to Peter and Sarah. Peter, you do regression um, hypnosis therapy, bringing yes. out these past lives. Has everybody here been here before? <clears throat> Um, I don't believe that everybody's been here before. I do believe that there are new people arriving all the time. Uh, I, get, I come across this sometimes in my work, um, that uh, when I try to regress people, there is nothing there to go back to. Mm. Uh, and that they are like new souls just arriving, just about to start learning, as Mr. Roach says, everything that you need to learn to, to build up the person that you are. Uh, but the majority of the people that I do regress um, have had past lives, yes. Yeah, and some were animals even, which is fascinating when you've That's taken correct. them back. Um, how does that work out? How, how do you know that they're being dolphins or wolves or whatever? Yeah. Nikki. Well, sometimes when I regress to people, um, when I'm asking them questions, they can't answer my questions because they, as an animal, I don't believe they understand what I'm saying to them sometimes. Uh, but what I do is I ask them, well, do you have any feelings or emotions? What's, what do you feel or sense right now? And uh, in the occasions when I've had dolphins, uh, they tell me that they have a feeling that they're surrounded in like a liquid and they're rising and then they're coming back right. down again like they're taking a breath. There are others around them doing the same so thing. There's clues. There are clues to it, And yes. you were a Roman centurion. Well, unfortunately, I've never been regressed. Um, I'm, I'm personally being blocked about going back into my past lives. I've been told by people in the know, uh, spiritualist uh, medium, that uh, there are things that happened to me in my past lives that were not very nice. Right. And so they're stopping me from actually going back. Yeah. But I, I personally believe, because I've got this infinity with York, it's like I'm coming home every time I go to York, that I was a, a Roman soldier actually in York at some stage. Yes. Wow. And, and Sarah, you were Sarah. Tamara, and you found Tamara's grave. Uh, we found her on the census um, when I was regressed by Peter um, he's very clever because he gets dates and names and places and everything Who was out tomorrow? of you um, she was just a scullery maid in London in 1856 at the point I was regressed but having she was about 19 then having researched her she was a woman who ended up living in a village in Northamptonshire which is where I live now having moved from London Coincidence, yeah. yeah it's, there's a lot of startling coincidences Amazing. with her life and mine and I came away from it all just believing that yes we are definitely reincarnated uh, and Kevin, very I, much what William over there has what said. Been saying, yeah. and, and Kevin you were a, a French prince yeah I found myself back in 1426 being a French prince um, rescuing King Henry V's daughter from um, some villages um, went through quite a lot of his life in great detail. You're tempted to go over and claim your land. <laughs> <laughs>